Yeah. Look like a couple of y'all go both. They do. They do both you offense and D line. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. That's what's up, man. Um, Game for like how you think you've been playing this long or in high school what you wish you would have did this something you know to leave them with yeah I'm, I'm thinking back because when i was in high school that was back in 2000 and like two to six <laughs> um but yeah um when i was in high school uh my biggest thing was doing the extra you know what i mean the things that were nobody's watching so i used to um i used to run bleachers um during the summer i used to um I used to be like lift the extra weights with my pops. Um, I used to run around my block. Um, but basically, what I'm saying is, it's the extra when you're not here with with them. You know what I mean? Like, what are you doing? Um, I was getting tapes from um, Jim Brown and John w uh, Wooten. So they used to send me tapes on other offensive linemen, um, even defensive linemen, to kind of just show me how I need to react, how I need to move. And this at the highest level in the NFL at a young age. Um, so if you could go ahead and you could like look at tape, you know, look at the way you critique yourself, um, do the extra when you're at home. I mean, I started off, I know, I know I'm swole now, but like when I started off, um, I was doing 10 push-ups, 10 sit-ups, and then I would, I would run. You know what I mean? That's all I was doing. When I got into high school, I was able to do, you know, 200 push-ups, 200 sit-ups, and, and run a couple, couple miles every day. Um, it's just all about the work you put into it. It's all a mental game. As you guys already know, uh, school is important. Um, but, you know, it's, everything is a mentality. You know, my mentality was like, all right, this is my goal, and this is what I got to do to reach that goal. Um, for you guys, this is, this is really, really important because you can build the foundation for college and any further, you know, uh, God willing. Um, so when he's over here telling you guys that you guys need to be more aggressive, and he's saying that he don't want to remind you. That's because it's a mindset. It's already a mindset that like, okay, I'm going to visualize this as a game situation. And in a game situation, you're not going to have fast it because that's how you get hurt. You know what I mean? You know, you got to go 100% to keep yourself healthy. You know, health is really important as well. So, I mean, whenever you told to fire your hands, I mean, try to shock the person across from you. You know what I'm saying? You just see that head snap. You know, sit, hear the breath leaving their lungs. You know, stuff like that. Um, Really, man, to me, it was all about the glory. And then, you know, the money came. So, uh, you know, I know that you guys got, got high aspirations for yourself, um, but you gotta be able to tell yourself, critique yourself, and be true to yourself if you're gonna wanna come out and get it every single day. Because I've done thousands upon thousands of reps of every drill that you can imagine over and over again and still I wake up and come out here playing with these fools. So you know as a as a twelve year vet talking to you guys, you know, it's 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 all about that mentality. It's all about your health. And just have the mindset that you just gonna fuck somebody up because they not gonna care about you. You know what I mean? Y'all got any questions for me? I got one. Uh, what's one thing that you feel like been able to carry you for twelve years in the league? Like one of your best traits that you feel like it's 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 my it's my work ethic and my faith, man. You know what I'm saying? My, my my faith is a big portion of that because there are a lot of things unseen that can happen to you, um, that you know sometimes happen from left field, and my faith is gonna keep me in check. My work ethic is what leads me. I'm a very talented individual. Everybody talk about my feet, the way I move, powerful, all that stuff, but I had to work every single day. Um, feet came from doing extra ladders and extra bleachers. Strength came because I've been working my ass off in the weight room. Um, I've had three surgeries in my shoulders, so I've had to go from benching 500 pounds back to 175, then back up to 500 pounds, then back to 175, and now I'm at 550. Like, it just, it doesn't matter. You know what I mean? It's just what you choose to do. So for me, that work ethic has carried me the whole long, the, the whole way. You know, if we had a free agent come in and they changed my position, all right, fine, I'm about to be the best at this new position. Turns out, He's getting hurt. I'm playing well at my position. They switched me back to his, to, to my old job. I do my old job well, and now they're all conflicted in the front office. Like, do we put them here? Do we put them there? Well, we just got to try to get our five best players on the floor, and that's what I did. And, you know, uh, I got $80 million to show for it. So it's like, it's, it's just the same formula. The shit gets old. It's tiring. It's exhausting. But it don't matter. I got two kids. I got a family that need me, and I got to leave a legacy. So, you know, that's what it's all about.
I appreciate it. Yeah, man. Appreciate no it. problem at all. Hey, man, good luck to y'all boys.